Once a month, I like to cook a Côte de Boeuf when I'm home. So I'm going to share with you all the steps I'm using to achieve the result I like. First, choosing the right piece of meat. You need to be dry age, the bone in, a little bit of fat of the outside to make it more flavorful. A nice cast iron pan, some butter, some garlic, and some salt. And of course, a little bit of oil to start the process. First, you need to season the meat with salt on both sides and then place it over a paper towel for 10 to 15 minutes to absorb all the excess moisture. Then you're ready to roast. First, I have the pan on a high heat so it gets extremely hot, almost smoking. I'm going to pour the oil into it. And you see it's extremely hot. I'm going to sear the beef on one side. And while I'm cooking the meat, I'm going to baste the fat over the meat. The next step is to see if the meat is caramelized enough. We need to wait a little bit longer. Flip the beef on the other side, continue the roasting. And I continue basting the meat so we have to caramelize and cool down the fat around the meat inside the pan. So now I'm going to remove some of the cooking fat. I'm going to add some butter inside the pan, almost half of it. And I'm going to keep continuing basting the meat. And now it's time to add the garlic. And you can see that the butter is bubbling around the meat. This is an indication that the temperature is perfect. The butter is browning but not burning. Now it's time to add the rest of the butter. You can press on the meat and feel the resistance. You can also use a thermometer and then if you reach 110 degrees Fahrenheit then you will be medium rare. If you want to reach medium you will push to 130 degrees Fahrenheit then well done it's good luck. The last step a touch of further cell over the meat then the meat will need to rest for about 15 to 20 minutes and then you can be sliced. And I always use the cooking batter. When the meat is sliced, I pour a little bit of the cooking batter over the meat. It's so flavorful and wonderful to eat with.